What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel, and today we have Gary Anderson through the years, one of the greatest kickers in NFL history, one of the oldest players in NFL history. He didn't officially hang them up till he was already 45 years old. So we can kick things off in Madden 97. He played much longer, but my collection starts in Madden 97, where he is 60, where he has 66 kick power and a 73 kick accuracy rating. He was 25 of 29 that year, and he knocked home a 46 yarder for his longest field goal that went through. Through. So I'm at a 98. He's 124 overall, 80 kick power, 89 kick accuracy. The highest rated kicker was Morton Anderson at 137 overall. He was 29 of 36 and a long of 51 yards for that season. And Madden 99, Warren Sapp got hurt right before I kicked the field goal. I thought it was funny because he brought the ambulance for the big fella. Anyways, man, he's 95 overall. Talking about Gary Anderson, 79 kick power and a 90 kick accuracy rating. Now, he went a grand total of 35 for 35 that season. His longest was a 53-yarder, but unfortunately for the Vikings, he missed the field goal in the playoffs. That would have basically sent the Vikings to the Super Bowl to face the Broncos. Now, in Madden 2000, he's 98 overall, 90 kick power, 98 kick accuracy. He went 19 of 30 for that season, so I guess there was a little bit of a hangover from that missed kick in the playoffs. Madden 2001, 86 overall, 82 kick power, 83 kick accuracy and my man went 22 of 23 bouncing back and he knocked him a 49 yard of Madden 2002 that one bar kills me man that it just does I don't know why but it just does but he's 77 overall 84 kick power and an 89 kick accuracy rating right there he's just knocking everything home man he was 15 of 18 for the Minnesota Vikings and he knocked home a 44 yarder for his longest one and 2K2, he's 83 overall, and I know it's kind of blocked by the NFL 2K uh, cover, but they had an onside kick rating in 2K football, which is dope, which they never had in Madden. I mean, the more that we do, like, some 2K videos, the more EA just gets exposed for not knowing what the heck they're doing with Madden or, like, any other sports game that they tried to do. But anyways, Madden 2003, he's 82 overall, 83 kick power, 89 kick accuracy. He knocked home a grand total of... 18 of 23 kicks and he will he had a long of 53 so now let's move on to nfl 2k3 where he comes in at 78 overall as well he also has 66 kick power and an 80 kick accuracy rating now let's move on to madden 2004 where he comes in at 83 overall 83 kick power and a 91 kick accuracy rating now he went 27 of 21 and he uh, 27 of 31 and he knocked home a 43 yarder ESPN for 2k5 he's 76 overall 68 kick power 80 kick accuracy now he also was in uh he also played in the 2004 nfl season which would have been madden 05 but he was not in madden 05 or in uh espn for 2k5 but he was 17 of 22 for his last year he was in madden 06 as a free agent and he was 80 overall for espn 2k4 and for madden 04 he was also a free agent but he played for the titans that season so that's why i put him there now, when we add up all of his overalls and all the games that had an overall for him, he is 87.4 as a NFL video game character. Now, coming up this Sunday, I have my first part two. It's going to be with Tom Brady. We're going to do Tom Brady right, man. I might do the whole thing over and just add Madden 17 and Madden 18 at the end. So be on the lookout for that. We got some more 30 years before then as well. But until then, hope that the rest of your day is the best of your day. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I'm out. Peace. Hi, sir.